Shoes full of bands, watch full of boulders. Room full of bitches, all um eights are over. Refrigerator full of rose, no soda. Unless it's Friday, that's only for my homies to pull up. And hopefully, you watched my last video showing you how you hook up a car or a sub amp and sub. Well, I'll show you how to hook up two amps now. This kid's just a little bit more difficult, but still really easy. All right, well, you know, you're gonna have all your power wire, RCAs, remotes, everything else. But now, you come with the power wire. You're gonna take the power wire down. You're gonna take it down, and then bam, you get into one of these guys right here. This is called a distribution box. All right. This one takes the four gauge in. It puts two four gauges out. All right. So then you're gonna take one of these, run it, bam, into the power. You're gonna take the other one, run it along here, and bam, into the power. There's your power. And now how I was talking about the bolt in the trunk. You know, the ground in your trunk. Well, you're going to start here for the ground. You're going to take your ground up. Run it up. Into this distribution block. Four gauge in. Two four gauges out. Now, you're going to take one of those grounds. Run it into the ground on the amp. You're going to take the other ground. And you're going to run it around into the ground on the other amp. There, power and ground done. Bam, got that out of the way. Quick and simple. Distribution box. Alright, now how you run the remote off the head unit. You're going to take it into whatever amp you want. Just say you take it into this amp first, right? So I got it running. You got the remote in there. But now you're going to splice the other wire into the same remote. You're going to take that wire, that remote wire right here, and you're going to run it into the remote on the other end. Remote wire is taken care of. Now all I got left is the RCAs. Alright. Get the RCAs running from the head unit. And you're running in, it's running in the sub amp first. This has inputs and the outputs on this amp so we don't need splitters right here so you have the input this is coming from the head unit and you have the pass through which is the output to hook the other amp, uh, another amp up so you plug these RCAs in here and you run them along run them along like this like so and bam into the input See now this amp doesn't have any outputs. It only has two sets of inputs. Since it's a four channel amp, these are the rear for these two for the rear for these two channels. And you have the uh the front inputs right here for these two channels. So if you wanted to hook up these two channels, the, the front channels, you're going to have to take splitters off these. But if you want to know how to do that, you're going to have to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and uh, subscribe. And if you want to know how to use splitters, well, click the subscribe, subscribe button wherever it is. And then uh, stay tuned. Thanks for watching.